What's up, guys? Welcome back to Roleplay. I've been going into hour number two here of week number 19. Riley, this shadow that you saw on the uh, tree behind you is no longer there. However, you were sure that you saw it. And when uh, when the man says... Did I get a real response from the guy? A real response? Yeah. What was your question? Um, I pointed at the shadow, and he saw it in his peripheral vision. And I asked how we fight it, or if we can fight it. Um, he, he okay, looks you at you. Something. He looks at you, and he goes, "You can fight anything that moves." And then, as soon as he says that, uh, two creatures jump on him, and they actually attack him at his back. Two of them jump at, uh, or one of them jumps at Riley. One of them jumps at Ricardo, and one of them jumps at Cobblepot. The one that jumps at me, I'll fuck him up. Because my sword is out, do they jump onto my sword and impale themselves? No. <laughs> uh. Let's see here. Hold on, I gotta figure out a name for someone. So they dodged my sword. Yes. Uh, this is. My sword that's pointing at them. They dodged that one. Yep. Yep. Okay. Time for some rolls. These things, uh, when they latch onto you, or sorry, when they come at you guys. Um, you know what, we can roll for initiative, because Riley, you saw them. Uh, but when they come at you, they are basically, from what you can tell, just moving shadows. Uh, and you guys are a little bit disturbed when you see these shadows not being cast on anything. They are just solid black figures moving about. Four. You guys go first. There's two on the man, there's one on Riley, there's one on Ricardo, and there's one on Cobblepot. Uh, I had my bow drawn. Yes, you did, Neil. And you do see yes. these things. Um, or do any of them have their backs to me? Uh, you can't tell because they are shadows. Are any of them attacking somebody and that person is... Be no, uh, are, we, is, are they between me and anybody that I am in the party with? Uh, I don't actually know. Let me see if you can get back attacks on these things. It doesn't really say. I mean, at least I'm looking for the plus two bonus to hit. I don't know if if they're made of shadow. I probably couldn't get the thief stabbing. Yeah, yeah. Back. You you would you can get a, a plus two bonus. Yeah, on I'm one. Just looking for that uh, bonus. Let's say you attack the one. Uh, let me just roll a dice. Yeah, you can. Uh, you see the. You see one that has its back turns to tor turned to you, Jesus. That is attacking Ricardo. The other ones Excellent. are all jumping like towards their general direction. So I'm gonna make attack. I, I don't stabbed know if I one on me. Surprise or not? So 10, uh, 12. If I have surprise. Hold on, Caitlin's rolling. You, you rolled horribly. You missed both times. What did you say? I only have ever rolled that bad over. <laughs> I, I roll a ten to hit, twelve if I have surprise, which I don't know if I have surprise or not. A plus ten to hit? No, no, no. I, I rolled should. a total of a ten. I rolled a three plus seven is ten. Oh, oh, I didn't know you rolled. Sorry, I didn't know you rolled. Yeah, uh, your arrow just goes passing off into the in the forest. You're not really sure uh, where it went. Uh, Riley, I need you to roll a save versus death for me. Another d20. So I want to roll high or low? It's you want to roll no. above save your save versus, versus death on your character sheet. Which you actually might have gotten new saving for. Hold on. <laughs> no, it's not going to cut it. That doesn't <laughs> count. Uh... As you go to attack this thing, you are expecting it to, uh, you're expecting your blade to meet against some sort of solid object, and it goes right through this thing, and you plummet to the ground, you drop your sword, you'll have to pick it up next round. <clears throat> That'll be your Let's action say. for next round. So do I die? No, no. Save versus death is just a term for saying, like, something's bad gonna happen to you if you fail the save versus death. It's not you're actually saving versus death. It's just a oh, general really? term. Oh, really? This whole time? Yeah. No, it's just a uh, general term. Got me. Uh, I say, guys, there's shadows. We need light. Burning hands! Okay. Uh, did I make you, do I make you roll for a d20 to hit? I do, right? Uh, I don't remember. Pretty sure I do. Roll a d20. Let's see if you hit. But it's, uh, I think it's... Or, no, is it a ranged attack? 
Yeah, it's an AOE. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. 120 uh, degrees, 5 roll, feet long. Roll your damage. Also, who are you? which one are you casting it on? The one attacking you? Um, if there's two... If yeah, that one, and if I can include one one more in the circle, uh, uh, you yeah. can, but you'll end up hitting Riley at the same time. Is Riley weak? She has like twenty HP. No, I like thirty HP, man. Go for it. Unless he kills me, then don't do it. <laughs> um. So yeah, I guess I'll go for the Riley one as well. <laughs> okay. Make your damage roll. <clears throat> uh, regal goblins. Nope. There. Roll. D3 plus 4. Correct? Is that it? Uh, if that's what it says in the spell. I trust you. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Uh, the thing in front of you uh, is hit by the fire. You hear it hiss a little bit as it does. Uh, but it does not fall down. Riley, you take five damage, and the thing attacking you also hisses. Uh, I'm going to make my second shot now? Yes, Wait, go ahead. I, have really, I, haven't, I haven't done an action. Oh, yeah, sorry. Okay. Cobblepot, go ahead. Um, so, what I've been doing, I've been a little distracted. I've been going through our Skype conversations to see exactly what spells I have for today, and we talk so fucking much on Skype, I can't find this shit. So, like, oh, I don't oh. know. So, time to meta game. Uh, I don't know what second. spells I have right now. At my let's Mega say mob. let's say you have uh, your current spells minus what your level three spells were. So you do not have. Yeah, you do not have those last two that you messaged me. Okay, so I've got all the rest of them. Yes. Okay. Um, I I'll just use my um, holy shock. I'll try and holy shock them. Sick. Okay. Holy shock should produce light. Roll your damage. <clears throat> Okay. Uh, well, I got So these shadows are not actually like shadow based, right? Like they don't disappear when they see light. I guess mm. they don't give a shit. They did not disappear when you cast burning hands. I don't think I hit with the holy shock. Uh, I gotta be touching them. No, you do not hit. Okay. It is the enemy's turn. Uh, the two. Where's my other die? The two on top of your. Bear man friend, uh, go to strike at him. And... <laughs> got JP calling. What, I don't get my second man. attack. Oh yes, roll your second attack. Bam, twenty-two. Uh, yes, that is a hit, not a crit. Three damage. Okay. Uh, and you right were attacking through. the one on Ricardo, right? That's uh, yeah. Is? Yeah. It, uh, Ricardo and Neil and Coronado, you guys both see this shadow in front of you disappear. Oh, awesome. Nice shot, Coronado. Okay, uh, the two go to attack this bear man. And his AC is okay. Uh, first one goes to hit. Save versus death. It's okay. That one, uh, just falls to the ground. He'll have to, or he, he, Falls off the man. He'll have to stand up and figure out a new target next round. Uh, the other one goes to attack again. And, uh-oh. He does indeed hit this guy. Four. Uh, okay. Um, you see uh, one of these things lash at the, the man in front of you. And when he does, uh, the man like basically falls down on one knee. And uh, you hear him exclaim, they'll sap your strength, do not get hit. And then these other ones, one goes to attack Riley. Riley, your AC is 16. It misses you. That uh, goes to attack Cobblepot. It misses you. And that's it. Let's roll for initiative. <clears throat> Someone roll D10. I'll roll. You guys go first. Oh, Joe. We're first? Yes, go first. I'm going to go again with the Holy Shock because uh, it doesn't use it up unless I like grab him and attempt to do it. So I'm, I'm going for the grab. Okay. 18. Yes, nice. you do hit. D4 per level and level 5. 
16. You uh, take your hands and like clasp them on what you think is this thing's head of the shadow and send this holy shock through him and you just see this thing like explode in a luminous light in front of you and it uh, it is no longer present. Sick. Sick. So is my my offense was on the ground and I have you can attack you turn? can attack with one hand this weapon or this this round or you can pick while up your sword. Can I attack with one hand while moving towards my sword? Yes, but you still have to pick it up as an action. So next round you would have to pick it up. I'll just attack with my main hand. I'm assuming that because my offhand rolled the lowest, that's my offhand that dropped. Uh, main hand first, offhand second. So yeah, if you dropped... Yeah, yeah, so it's your main hand that's attacking. Uh, that's a hit. That's not a crit. Roll your damage. Uh, I forget the. Are they large, medium? Uh, I think it's just a D8. It's it's normal size creature. Uh, yes, normal size creature, for six damage. Okay. You slice into this thing with uh. With Rev, and it stumbles back a little bit, but it is still standing. Uh, yeah, cats, what are you doing? Nolf's acid arrow. You reach into your bag to collect the uh, reagent for this and realize that there are none. <sighs> and when you woke up this morning, you could have sworn that there were enough reagents for the spell in your bag. Yeah, because I only thought I needed reagents for like two spells. Um, I'll be like, well... Someone's been stealing from me my reagents, guys. So I can't cast Melf's Asset Arrow. This is an issue. Um, the man standing with, with one thing on its shoulder and the other in front of him says, This is no time for bickering of stolen items, sir. Please fight. Oh, really? <laughs> is that so? <laughs> I'll staff my thing. My shadow. Not my shadow, because mine's dead, right? Like the one that was following me? Yes, there is not so, one in front of you. There's one in front oh, of Riley, too, and there's two on the bear man. I'll staff one of uh, Riley's. Bear man can die for all I care. He's a douchebag anyway. <laughs> okay. Roll a d20. Uh, you strike at this thing, and uh, for whatever reason, maybe you're scared of this, or you just misjudge. You seem like you're right about to hit, and then the, your staff misses. GG. Yeah, Neil, go ahead. Okay. Whoops. I don't know uh, where you just rolled. I messed up. I hit something wrong. Hit the wrong thing. There, so, there we go. Okay, you hit. Okay. Um, what? <laughs> what are you talking about? How much was it? $30. Right, right, right. I know that, Neil. Uh, so an arrow, <laughs> you, you guys hear an arrow come off from about 30 feet away, and um, you hear, what? what's your name again? You hear Coronado exclaim, Ricardo, move! And then all of a sudden, Ricardo, you get struck with an arrow in your in your um, uh, like your, the side of your arm, and you take two points. It of hits damage. Ricardo. Oh. What? Yes. I just got struck by an arrow. So you're at eight HP. At weird. Is that everyone? I get two attacks per round. Go ahead. <sighs> oh, fucking hell! Get to finish uh, Ricardo off now. <laughs> uh, okay. That is a max damage. Max damage? I think. Sick. How much is Okay, so max damage is three, four? Four times damage dice? Is that four right? times damage dice. So it's a hit, so that's one, <laughs> two, three, four. Yeah, four times whatever. 
Cool. And I can't get back attack bonus on these shadow guys, right? Right. Cool. So that should be 4d6 to the shadow. Uh, what is... Hold on one second. Let me do some math. Okay. Uh, again, uh, you hear a bow shot come off, and we should probably wait till Katz puts his heads back, headset back on. <laughs> you guys hear a bow shot fire off from the distance. Once again, you hear Coronado exclaim, yes. Ricardo, please look out! And you take a blow to your arm, Katz, and take 16 damage. What the fuck? I'm really dead. Are you kidding me? You take six damage. Damn. But I so you're died. you're at negative eight. Right? No, no, you're actually just dead. Eight minus sixteen is Seriously? eight minus eight. So Fucking... no, no, no. You're 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 at negative, negative eight. You're at negative eight. Yeah. You just fall yeah. over, Ricardo. Okay. Uh, is that everyone's uh. turn? Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, the the man gets to attack. That's right. Uh, what is his role? Oh my god. I yell out, I knew you were bad news, Cora. They go. Jesus, he gets. Okay. Uh, that's a hit. That's a hit. Thank and god you killed him, Ryan. That is a hit. Yeah. Uh, you see the, the bear man basically just like lunge at this creature, and as you do, you notice that. His, uh, what were once man hands have now actually started to change into these lupine looking gigantic mitts with giant talons on the end. He just claws into one of these creatures and you see his, his face slowly change into something that has a snout on it with a large row of teeth. And he goes in and bites this thing and just destroys it and it disappears into thin air. But then he slips and hits cast for two damage? No. <laughs> good, good. Um, okay, so there is one creature left. There's one in front of Riley, and there's one in front of this creature. Uh, you're at negative eight, so you have two rounds left, and you will die. Unless you are healed, by the way. Thank uh, you. This thing goes to attack Riley. What is your AC? 16. Fuck, ma'am. This thing goes to attack you and misses. It goes to attack the other creature. Fuck, save death. Fail. And he stumbles aground on the ground. He will not get an attack next round. Initiative. The bear man or the ghost? The ghost. Oh, the, the creature. creature. I would say Ricardo roll it, but he's distracted. I'll roll. What? Oh. Nine. Creatures go first. The final one, or the one of final two goes to attack Riley. God damn it. <laughs> misses and the other How one doesn't do you want me dead so bad? I want one of these things to hit because that's what their cool thing is but they won't fucking hit except for the bear man roll y'all guys turns so right. if I'm standing right on top of my sword can I just pick it up if you're what if I'm standing on top of my sword can I just pick it up and then use it if you go to pick it up you will incur an attack from the creature as it is right next to you can I do a stabbing and picking up simultaneous motion? You can only attack or you can pick it up. And do like, something else when but I not attack, attack. I use both hands. So I can just pretend that I'm attacking with my, my off hand, but really it's just attacking the ground into my sword. Into a grass. So you're motion. wanting to fake an attack? No, I'll just, I'll just go. I'll the, op just the options are you can attack with one. I, with go, I go to stab. I miss. It's okay. I miss. <laughs> okay. okay. You miss. Do I still have back attack on these creatures, or is this like flank or? Flank uh, the other one is is to your side, so you can get a plus one. You'll get a flank. Okay. Uh, attacking that guy. Fifteen. That is a hit. Nice. Five damage. Okay. The shadow takes a. Uh, an arrow to its side. And is that everyone else? This one, it sticks in the shadow this time, right? Yes, it does. Okay. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Ryan, what are you doing? I am... I've been down... Am I close to Ricardo? Uh, you can run over to him and get a spell off, yeah. Heal time. We're casting Cure okay. Moderate Wounds. Okay. D... Is it D-tip? 
It's D10 plus D4. Damn. Give it to me, baby. 12, bro. 12. You are brought up oh. to 2 HP, but... Uh... No, he's at 4. He's at 4. I'm at 4. I'm at 4. Oh, you're at 4. Also, we should have rolled for critical hit table, shouldn't we, Abneil? If you yes. max crit him. Can you look uh, that yes. up real quick? Um, saving throw oh, versus God. death, Ricardo? Ricardo, roll a d20. Oh, uh, what's... This is ridiculous. Am I might be being killed again? Maybe. You rolled a oh, d20. 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 Oh, I was going to say. D20. Oh, whoops. whoops. Wait, do I want to roll a 20 or not a 20? Yes, you want a 20. You want yes. high roll. Not, yeah. want, uh, not low. I okay. believe that's, that's a pass. High that's yeah. a pass. Yeah, yeah, you're cool. You're saved. Okay. So he's at four. I'm so then it guys, doesn't. Then the crit table doesn't come into effect, right, Neil? Correct. Okay, yeah. Uh, second attack? Yeah, second attack, Coronado. Uh, okay. D20 okay. plus six. 18. That is I a hit. Four damage. Okay. You do. F and you're attacking the one on the man or the one on Riley? Um, I think you're on oh, the one on the man, or, yeah. Okay, whatever I can get the flank attack on is what I'm yeah, going for. Yeah, that's the one on the man. Okay. Uh, I need to roll for initiative. Please let me go first and hit Riley. <laughs> I'm gonna roll okay. Ryan, how much did you kill Ricardo for earlier today? 12. No, 12. I haven't. Go for it, Jesse. That's I'm the not first scared. heal I've passed all, the whole time. Okay. How did Ricardo get killed me. then? He did. Was at, he was at 1 HP at the, uh, yes, at the end of last week. He was at 1 uh, HP, that's true. Did you not heal him? He got. No, he got healed from the. Uh, it's a new episode. We all start at max <laughs> HP heal. Yeah. <laughs> we had dual. Remember? And he was at. Like, you brought him back to 1 HP. Why are you trying to kill me? <laughs> I'm just I, trying to play by the I, rules, bro. It's too late. I, well, I don't, I don't think I brought him back up now. to full. I, uh, Chat, was there a heal week, on Ricardo? I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't remember if you got healed last week, is all. If he was at 1 HP, Why then he's I actually dead. HP? Why was if I at 1, at 1 HP? HP? Remember you challenged yes. me to a duel? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Remember? But we haven't slept since? I don't know. It's still the same day. This that is going to be like the most anticlimactic death. Yeah, this it will be the most <laughs> anticlimactic death. <laughs> and due to the rules, you're actually just dead. Yeah. Due to the, what do you mean due to the rules? <laughs> what do you mean? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> but you like, were so breaking anything. Like, That's literally. You do not remember does, this. Does eating, does eating food replenish health? No. no. Only sleeping How and could, heals. Resting and magic. How could you not remember this? How could you not remember this before? How could you not remember this before? Now? How, how can you not remember? I thought I was full HP. Why would you think you're I, full HP? And why did you not? Why did we not heal you? So here's how come actually come here's what actually would have gone like, down. Uh, okay, listen. Here's how it actually would have gone down. If Ricardo was at one, then Mel's first shot would have dropped Ricardo to negative one, and I would have gone over for a healing action, and the sixteen wouldn't exactly. have hit Ricardo in the first place. That's how Thank it would have gone down. Yeah. There, that's that's a pretty logical statement. I can't argue with at all. So actually, this lawyering is going to put Ricardo at higher HP than he would have been. Possibly. See, higher. see, and you're starting to get mad at me. We we'll lawyer everything. It's always going to work out for us. In my opinion. All right, Ryan. Ryan, if you yeah. let's do this. So you would have healed Ricardo before the fight with a cure light wounds, correct? Mm, I. If he was at one HP before. Like going out into the world. If you knew he's at one HP, you would have used a cure light wounds, correct? Probably so, yes. Give me a D eight and a D four. If he's at one HP with a max of ten, roll your uh five. Five. So it brings him up to six. He took two damage and then he took sixteen. Ricardo, Three you're dead. <laughs> no <laughs> He still would have died regardless if the hill didn't if the hill happened. Wait, but what what's the two? Is, but a risk. Hold on, hold on, time out. But I don't think that's fair. Like, that's how is it, that not it fair? Can't be, it can't be because you can't speculate. Would you have healed him going into that? Like, I, I didn't do it. No, no, you would have healed him throughout the day. What I'm saying is, if if he was at one HP and you knew he's at one HP, and we remembered that he was one HP, you would have healed him. That is your heal roll, the D8 plus D4. For five I, I, damage. I get that part. I'm just saying it opens. It's a slippery slope because now I can go back and retroactively. Oh, if I knew he was at one HP, I, I would have healed him. Argument. It is use. retroactive, but it was only because 
Katz is dead regardless if you didn't heal him. So that's why we went back and did it. This won't happen in future games. All I'm saying is it it's, it's establishes a dangerous precedent. It does. That's why okay. this is not a precedent. This is a one-time event. No. How is this a one-time event? It's gotta be. It's gotta be like this. Is because the, you can't just be like, oh, I heal everyone up before fight. Just I, I use all my health spells before he fight. So it, so it creates a death for Ricardo. He's dead if you don't heal him. If you don't want to heal him, then he's still dead. Because he's at no, one. No, but if I, okay. But he, listen to the other thing I'm saying. Like if if he was just at one, so I didn't heal him. He's at one. Then yeah. he takes the two from Neil. Neil he took a second pops. shot. At the but he wouldn't have hit Ricardo's dead corpse, right? The arrow would have kept going. That I guess that is a lawyer move, and I don't know how to get around that. That's pretty good. Yeah, that was you, pretty I mean, good. you have to make a call as a DM. Hold on. Oh, no, I did do two damage the first time, not three. Okay. You did two damage so the first I do, time? So I do two damage he would have to fallen Ricardo. Over. Knocks him down to negative one. Is the shadow still attacking him when he falls down? Or does the shadow move on no, to the next No, it probably target? would have gone to something else. So you might have actually just lawyered him out of dying. Yeah. You, you would have actually just crit the shadow. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You're alive, yep. Ricardo. Good. <laughs> Good lawyering <laughs> for yourself, man. So I'm thinking about killing someone tomorrow, Ryan. Do you be my lawyer for that? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I was going to be a lawyer if I wasn't in the eSport business. Okay, so regardless, you do heal Coronado back up. You were at negative negative one and you healed him for... What was that roll? The first one I rolled was a, a 14. Or 12, sorry. So, he'd 12. Be at, so he's at max, but... He, max. Okay. Yeah, you come back to life at, uh, you come back to life after being unconscious. <coughs> you regain consciousness yes. and you look around, but you can't make actions. Uh, is that everyone I for this round? I feel like I almost died. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, right. I'm rolling to attack Riley. Uh... Are you fucking kidding me? God yes! damn it. <laughs> Fuck you, JC. Then goes to attack Riley and swipes at you and misses. The other one goes to attack the man with you guys and just completely misses. Y'all's turn. All right. Do I, do I attack this turn, or am I still? What? No, no attack for you this uh, do turn. Do I get to it? Okay. Uh, do we have to roll initiative, or do no, we you, go? It, oh, no, that no. Was, okay. it's y'all's turn. Uh, D20 plus 6 against the shadow still. Uh, one for back. I'm still on flank, right? Uh, yes. Miss. Second attack. 14. Uh, that is a hit. The 14 is a hit. Two damage. Okay. All right. Bring it all. Um, yeah. Real quick, does uh, level five um, cleric? What should my melee adjust be total right now? Oh, Probably a plus Jesus. two. It's either plus two or plus three. I can never remember. Where's my player's handbook? Um. So every three levels, you gain a plus two to hit. So it should so, only um, be a plus one then. So at level two, you get a plus zero. Level three, you get plus one. Level four, you get plus two. Level five should still be plus two. Level six, I think, is plus three. And level seven is plus four. I'm not sure. I, let me double check. I'm... You get a plus two. I'm looking at the calculated Deco table uh, cool. right now. It's a plus two, Sweet. Ryan. So, overall, okay. Yeah, D20 plus two. Okay. Um, I, I will take a swing at one of the shadows. Four. Good thing I asked. <laughs> Could have okay. maybe hit it. Uh, if I hold... Oh, sorry? No, no, Riley, it's your turn. Okay, right, if I hold uh, my main hand with both hands, so I get a bonus to hit. Is it a long sword? It's a long sword, yeah. Uh, no, no bonuses to hit. If it was a bastard... Yeah, I... Well, you wouldn't get any bonuses to hit regardless of what weapon you hold, but you would get bonus to damage if it was a bastard sword. Um, I, I just hold my sword with both hands anyways, and oh, I go okay. to slice at the creature in front of me. It would, you know, like, I don't really know what to do. Like, I don't have a pocket. I can just put it in, so I, I just hold it anyways. Okay. Okay. That no is mess. a miss. Uh, the okay. man goes to attack. That is a hit. That is a hit. 
And Jesus, this guy is just owning. Mm -hmm. That is a hit. So what is the damage here? Uh, let's just roll this. Uh, okay, the man finishes off the target attacking him. You just see him claw at this thing and bite into it, and it uh, disappears. So there's only one left on Riley right now. Let's roll for initiative. Please let me fucking hit. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I want to roll. Fuck. For yeah, you should roll, Riley. Did you get a ten, JP? Go ahead. You guys go first. All right, let's slice again. That is a hit. That is not a crit. You slash at this creature, uh, basically cutting its head off, and it evaporates into thin air. Are there any uh, left? Nope. That is the last creature that is slain. And as you guys, uh, as you deliver the final blow, you look over at the man, and he is a creature that looks like this now. If you can see that. On the webcam. Oh, it sounds frozen for me. Is it? Yeah, me too. Oh. Let's yeah. See. Waiting for it to come on. He's basically a bear man. <laughs> if that describes it. I don't think my camera's going to come on. Um, <clears throat> he's got uh, solid black hair. Start. Uh, very well muscled, hairy. Um, it just looks like a bear, man. The chat saw it. So you have a bear. What? I look like I'm surprised. Uh, you see the man, like, arch back on, or the, the creature in front of you, you see him arch back on the legs, on his hind legs in front of you, and he slowly starts to, to change back into a man before you. Do his clothes reappear? Nope, his clothes are all ripped. Okay. Is he really wearing, wearing like convenient shorts? He looks like the Hulk's pants, basically. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm perfect. <clears throat> and uh, once once he's like finished, he turns to you unless you guys say something, and he goes, "There will be more. We should return to town at once, or at least stay near the general population. We shouldn't be out should here." Should we alone. just all go together right now? If we do what? Yes, Who yes, at once. Let's, let's, let yeah. us get out of here. Are you safe, or do you need to stick with us now? He goes, well, if he's seen me with you now, there's no point in, in returning. And he pulls out the, the mirror, and he goes, I, 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 I will be watching this for quite some time to see what the man does with my wife. <coughs> Perhaps this. the spies could not return and inform them that... Is there a chance that they have not spotted you, that this was a scouting mission, or are you quite sure that you are... Spotted with they, us. I, I have seen these creatures before. They they work for, um, oh Jesus, they work for Uman. Uh, I, he turns towards uh, Ricardo and he goes, "Do you have any um, any skill in perhaps deceiving, and perhaps changing what can be seen through this portal?" And he holds up the mirror. I think that you're asking for a wall of fog. Which no one has ever asked for before. <laughs> he looks at you and he goes, How are you going to cast a wall of fog through this mirror? I'm asking if you have any way to get me into this area. I do not know where it is, but perhaps by looking at the mirror you could get me there. Do you have this power? How about we do what room that was? No, we don't know. The woman, where the woman is, is where he wants to go, right? Yeah, yes. but Cobblepot, weren't you in that room earlier? No, um, he was in the bear man's room. Yeah, I was I was in there, but uh I mean that thing with his wife, I don't I don't really understand the whole thing. Is your wife in this world? Is she on another plane? Where is she? I do not know where she is. My only contact has been through this mirror and it's only okay. I've only seen her a handful of times come into this room. How did you get this mirror? He gave it to me and said that if I was to perhaps slip up deceive him in any way, he would bring my wife and execute him so that I may watch. Execute her so that I may watch. <laughs> but why would you want me to try to deceive him then? You silly bear. Because I wish to save my wife. 
He has already seen okay. me with you. Um, listen, here's what I can do. I can identify the object and let it, it'll let us know exactly what it does. He goes, how mm, long will that that's, take? That's one day, one afternoon. And it would, but uh, um, it wouldn't. It wouldn't give us the location. Uh, uh, no, but it would at least tell us what the mirror does, so it could confirm if it's a different plane or something else. He goes. But, I, I yeah, have no. Right. I have no other. I have no other leads at all where this place may be. So if you can identify it, at least we can figure out how this thing works. He goes. Yeah. He, he hands you the mirror, and he goes. Um, uh, hold on, hold on. I have an I have an idea. 